Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the whiteboard and some of the settings in the whiteboard in Canvas in a Zoom meeting. So the first thing you're going to do is in Canvas you're going to click on Zoom and if you have your meeting scheduled you'll just go over to the start button and click that and then however you normally launch your meeting is what you're going to do. I just click in this dialog box on zoom.us on this Mac. That's going to open up the meeting. I can join with my audio. And here I am. Next, you're going to click on share screen. And you can select whiteboard. Once that's highlighted, you'll go down to the share button in the lower right corner and click that. And now you'll have the whiteboard as well as these annotation tools. So these tools, you can change the color of the drawing. You can draw, you can click text if you want to type. Um, you can also erase and clear. So I'm going to change it to red and go to draw. If you click on these little tools they open up the different options so you can do arrows or thicker lines etc. I'll choose this. I encourage you to play around with all of these in a practice meeting so you're familiar with what everything does. And then once you have your drawing tool you can just draw anywhere on the whiteboard if you want to work it out. And if you're more advanced you can use a pencil tool and actually use an iPad if you want and you can log into the Zoom meeting on the iPad as well as through the computer and that way you can use the iPad to draw. I'm not going to cover that, that's a little advanced but this is sort of the easy simple way to do a whiteboard in Canvas. Again you just have to click clear and you can click clear all the drawings. You also have an undo button that does things one by one. So that's basically what the whiteboard does. One thing I do want to show you is how to disable other participants from drawing on your whiteboard. Um, they might even just do it by accident. They might click on something and start drawing over your drawings. And in some cases you'll want them to have that ability, but uh, this is how to turn it off and on in your Zooms. So what you're going to do to access those settings is go up into the upper right corner and click on this more with the three dots and here you'll see down the list you have enable annotation for others if it says enable that means that the participants don't have the ability to draw on the whiteboard but if you click this then my students that are in the Zoom will then have these annotation tools show up and I can ask them to draw on here. If there's something that I don't like I can turn that off by again clicking more and then you'll see now it says disable annotation for others. So that's something that you want to be aware of when you're using the whiteboard. Alright that's it. Thanks for watching.